One of the big problems with whiteboards in an office is that unlike other digital drawing solutions, it's not saveable, it's not shareable, it's not collaborative. Uh, basically, it's great at showing a room an idea, but other than that, it's super inefficient. Now, having faith that technology in some form has to be able to help this archaic means of communication, I went in search of just that. And you know what? I think I found it. This is the eBeam Smart Marker Kit. The concept behind this device is that you can scan anything you write on a whiteboard, or any flat surface like glass for that matter, automatically digitize it and save it, as well as share it or even invite others to collaborate from their computers or phones in real time. How it works is it uses this sensor that can either magnetically attach to your board if it supports it, or it can attach using included command strips that you can easily peel off whenever you need to and they won't leave any residue. And it then tracks the marker and translates whatever it writes digitally and imports it into a custom app. To set it up, you turn on the sensor, open the corresponding app on your phone that you can download from your device's app store, turn on Bluetooth, it'll connect, and you're all set. You can also use a desktop app for Mac or Windows that you can download from their site and it connects via the included wireless dongle they provide instead. Once it is attached to the board and paired with the app, it'll track anything to the left or right in two eight by five foot squares by default. You can also go into settings though in the app and adjust it to just one side or the other and even create custom dimensions if you want. Now the other major component of this is the marker itself. And no, it isn't this crap ton of black markers that the company gives you, which is nice. It's this. This is a casing, essentially, that allows you to put in any marker you want that has a fine enough tip and fits. Recommended brands are normal ones that we've all heard of, so you don't have to necessarily use the included ones. Once you put a marker inside the casing, you can just start writing and instantly be able to see what you are writing in the corresponding app. From there, it's automatically saved and you can share it via whatever sharing service you want or to someone else's account that has the app as well. The neat thing about sharing via the app is that you can also share via a meeting and that allows other people to then draw on it with you in real time. Of course, you'll need a computer or something running the program when you're at the whiteboard so you can see the changes that they're making because, you know, traditional whiteboards can't update themselves. See, super inefficient. Also with the device, you can tap the button on it to save the current board to the app and start a new board. So now you can erase what's on the board and start over and not lose what was already there. Speaking of erasing, how does it know that you want to erase something that you don't want to save? Well, if you used a normal eraser, the device won't really be able to track that properly. So they've included a digital eraser. It takes one AA battery and erases any dry erase marker like normal using felt, but it has the added benefit of letting the system know where it is in space and what you are erasing. And just like with writing, it erases in real time. Now the system itself isn't cheap. It's $799 for the starter pack and a thousand for the complete set that includes four different colored markers. But since the only time I've really seen a whiteboard used that often is in an office, uh, it's not that bad of an investment for a company that at least wants to try to get their conference room to feel like it's in the 21st century. There you guys, I hope you enjoyed that. Um, I thought it was interesting even though I don't really have a whiteboard, just that this tech even exists. So hopefully some of you felt the same way if you don't have an office to put this in. Um, but let me know in the comments below what you guys thought of this. Would love to hear from you. Uh, and then if you did like this video, please thumbs up it or share it. It's greatly appreciated. And if you want more videos like this, please check out my channel. And if you like what you see there, please subscribe. Also, if you are subscribed or you are about to, please check that little bell next to the word subscribe so you get notifications whenever I do new videos and I don't get lost in all of your subscriptions, which is just sad. I appreciate it. As always though, Thanks for watching.